What do, man? It's your boy Battle Troop coming to you live and direct from the Battle Troop headquarters. Let's get off into this, man. Reed Dollars versus T Rex. Summer Madness 7. I'm not going to be long in this. I'm pretty sure everybody know Reed Dollars dying in this battle. Reed Dollars is dying in this battle. Reed Dollars don't stand a chance against T-Rex in this battle. Summer Madness 7 will be Reed Dollars' last and final battle. We just going to put him to rest. T-Rex going to regain his status because he going to do a working on that boy. He going to regain his status, be back on top again, and resurrect his career off Reed Dollars. That's all this is. T-Rex going to resurrect his career off uh, uh, Reed Dollars. Or if Reed Dollars beat T-Rex, guess what he do? Resurrect his career at least to get another battle and a big check. That's what this battle comes down to. Two has-beens resurrecting their career. Cause let you think, let you talk about it. Both of them right now in battle rap, forget what they did in the past. Right now, they nothing. They, this battle is to prove to the battle rap community and fans, from the media to the fan to the league owners, whether or not we want to accept them back again and believe in them again and get behind them and support them again. That's what this battle is about. Let's keep it real. Am I lying though, fam? Am I lying, family? That's what this battle was about. Before this battle was announced, we didn't give a damn where he was. We didn't give a damn where Rex was. We didn't give a damn where Reed was, and we didn't give a damn where Rex was. This battle was talked about so long, we don't even care no more, seeing how bogus they've been as of lately in their battles. So you always could bring two losers together, which works out for the losers, because at least they know this. We at least get to win the game. Somebody winning today. We both losers. Somebody winning today. So I have a chance of beating you. You have a chance of beating me. I at least get a win today. 50-50 chance I could get a win. Just like the NFL, when two garbage teams play up against each other, they like it because they know they have the potential of getting a win. That's all this is. This is the Phoenix Suns, uh, 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 the Phoenix Suns against the New York Knicks. Two garbage teams, which should be exciting because – somebody win. Somebody at least gonna win. But going up against somebody else, you gonna they that we know they gonna lose. So them two going up against each other, somebody career finna be resurrected. That's all this is. Resuscitating somebody else's career. Who career gonna be re resuscitated? If I'm a gambling man, if I have to make a bet, I have to go by Rex because we know greatness is in Rex. Where was the last time we seen greatness in uh, uh, Reed? He's still living off the Rambo thing. Nobody cares about him in chess battle. Nobody cares about him in a John John battle. He's still living, being respected off of the track with the Rambo. Get the grab with potato. That don't work no more in this day age. He tried to do that with John John and got booed horribly. Got bodied. Got assassinated. That was one of the worst body bags ever in battle rap history. Dead. I felt sorry for that man. Sandman should have been hooked that man by the neck with that cane and took him off that stage. That's how embarrassingly he got killed. Rex just don't. The difference between Reed and Rex is this. Reed tried to win. He tried to win with that trash material, and it don't go so well with him. Reed Dollars actually tried to win. He tried to beat John John with that trash. Rex don't try. Rex just don't give a damn. That's the difference between Rex being cocky. Rex be like, I ain't even finna really try to rap against you. I'm going to say these mixtape bars. They could boo me, say whatever they want. Get my check. I'm gone. Reed actually writing, y'all, in his mind, believing it's fire when it's so outdated. Rex not, that's them between Rex and Reed. 
We got mad at Rex because we saw him not giving a care. We saw him not giving a damn. We know he didn't write. He giving us his mixtape bars. And you know what's crazy about Rex giving us his mixtape bars? Let's just be honest. And some of those battles he was against, people giving him his mixtape bars, it sounded better than they rounds. When he went up against Rod B with them mixtape bars, he still was better than Rod B using mixtape bars. Come on now. Reed tried to win with that trash. Rex don't even try. That's what made us so mad at him. Because we know he didn't put no effort in there. We seen him being great. This battle should be no differently. I think Rex felt the pressure. He, had, he felt the pressure of the battle rap community. The man retired and nobody knew it. Think about that. Rex retired and came back and nobody knew it. Nobody knew he retired and nobody even knew he returned. He did a battle with Young X, his return back battle from being in retirement. Nobody knew. Nobody cared. He felt the effect of his name being diminished and not being mentioned again. And he hurt himself a lot. And I know he felt that. He felt that. Too many people came public out about it. From Rock to Mook. Those like his close inner people. Them like his close inner people. So he definitely felt that. He want to get back to greatness again. And I think he going to make an example out of Reed. He giving just the right person to get him back in the game. So strategically wise, some people on this card, I'm seeing that this is a branding. And uh, this card is built up because it's branding. It's positioning to brand certain people. If the keeps to surf out there, because keep it real. You are really ain't trying to push uh, Iron Solomon. I ain't trying to get behind him financially. Financially, they want to get uh, behind Surf because they know he's a big asset. If you put Surf on a card with Iron Solomon, Iron Solomon got to work twice and three times as hard to get accepted and approved by the people over Surf. They ain't going to never take Iron Solomon over Surf. This ain't King of the Dot. This ain't the Euro League. Nope, it ain't going to happen. So this card seemed like it built up for branding. I'm keeping it real. Where's my pen? I got to put this down. I'm doing a blog on this. Don't try to copy my stuff, neither, people. Well, they can try, but I still spit it so fire. I still spit it so fire. It ain't no way around it. But with that being said, that's exactly what this is. It's a branding card. Um, and you looking at this, and this what this is. T-Rex coming back on the scene. URL still want to get behind them, invest in them. Because at the end of the day, the number one crew is Dot Mob when it comes to Smack. Smack, no. You can't really say Smack or URL without saying Dot Mob. I'm going to keep it real. Smack know that too. He always feel entitled in some type of way to always reach back out, look out for them. Because they played a big part in building that brand. I'm keeping it real. They did. They did. That was one of the biggest, that was one of the first and biggest groups ever in battle rap. And they did, did they thing, man. And Smack, don't forget that. Smack, don't forget that. Rex told the secrets about that in Summer Madness too when he went up against Verb. He literally told them stories out. Mook did too. They know what it is. They may talk and say little things because it's a pride and ego thing when it comes to league owners and battle rappers. But at the end of the day, when it comes to them going up against other people, oh, they definitely come together. And the Midwest movement saw that firsthand. And they uh, collaborating and sabotaging and getting rid of it. Oh, I'm going to talk about that. But with that being said, man, I got Rex over Reed Dollars, man. Easy, man. I got Rex over Reed Dollars. Three zip. Three zip. I'm not expecting Reed to do nothing at all. I'm not impressed. I think I'm not impressed. He ain't going to even be as, as aggressive as Rex. You know what I'm saying? So it is what it is. I got Rex over Reed Dollars, man. Um... I think um, 
I think Reed going to try. He might try to come out and fight, but it just ain't going to be good enough. Rex going to do a thing on that Summer Madden card, man. It is what it is. I got T-Rex over Reed Dollars, man. Three zip, man. Rex over Reed. Three zip. Let's get it.